Plata State has suffered from several violent conflicts in the state. But for the special security outfit responsible for maintaining law and order in the state, their effort at enforcing peace is yielding results. Get back home, tell that to all your friends, your family members that peace has returned to Plateau State. And if we can do this individually, you can imagine how far the, the message will sent down to everybody. So I want to use the opportunity to ask you that we have more to gain in the atmosphere of peaceful coexistence than the violence that pervaded this uh, Plateau State in the past. Speaker of the Plateau State House of Assembly is concerned that the actions and inactions of politicians in the state could threaten the peace of the state. We should approach this forthcoming election in peace so that we will have the time to continue to enjoy this peace work after even the elections. So I want to appreciate you all and to say that as we go back, may God that brings us here back safely grant each and everyone back home safely. The president of the Plata Youth Council applauded the operation safe haven for the approach towards changing the security narrative of the state. We recognize what you're doing here on the plateau and we want to really, really thank you. Your approach to the security system has changed the narrative. And as the most important demography, we are determined not just to walk the peace, but to sustain the peace. The Let's Walk the Peace campaign attracted young people and members of the civil society to the event. From Joss, Mfon Obong, STV News.